Boba Fett? Yeah, Boba yeah. Fett, rookie card, man. Hey, why don't you bring it over here to this table? Let's check it out. Yeah, absolutely. So this is a 21 back uh, Boba Fett. So this is uh, Boba Fett on its rookie card. Came out in 1979. Boba Fett is probably like one of the most iconic Star Wars characters. He's definitely a fan favorite. Badass bounty hunter. My favorite Star Wars character for sure. This would have been made by Kenner. They obviously had a license to make Star Wars toys. So did you have it graded by CAS yourself? Yeah, man, came back with a 75. I think it was a little harsh grade for, for that particular figure, but, uh, but yeah, it's pretty solid. I know there's some way to tell us the B car on the back. Is it this right here? Correct, so the A car didn't have that figure, the do back. Yeah. yeah. How much are you looking to get for it? So I'm looking for 14,000. Okay, um, I knew they were expensive, but not that expensive. I'm very, very interested in it, but before I even think about dishing out anywhere close to $14,000, I want to talk to my guy, Steve. Yeah, sounds great. OK, um, I'm just going to take a couple pictures, if you don't mind. Yeah, sure thing. All right, just get that back picture. Um, I'm going to text him right now, shoot him these pictures. He knows we're out here, and he's ready to have a chat with me. I have a video room set up. I'm sure he'll be ready by the time we get there. All right, sounds great. Hey, Steve. Hey, Tom, how's Austin treating you? You know, Austin and Austin, I'm doing good. I got the pictures you sent. What a great item. I don't know too much about toy collectibles, just enough to get me in trouble. So I figured I would give you a call and you can maybe fill in the pieces for me here on this piece. Well, when you start talking about Star Wars, one of the most iconic characters is Boba Fett. He's very mysterious and he really drew to fans. It is a 21 bat. B, which is pretty much the first appearance card for Boba Fett. So you actually got the toy before he actually was on the screen. So in the world of collectibles right now and across the board, we've had the fall off. The market was over-realized. I think that was very understood. Um, and Star Wars market did go with it. In the height, what would this toy have been going for compared to what it's going for right now? At this grade level, a comparable piece sold around $30,000. Wow. OK, and what are we talking about in today's market? With what I see, it's a super collectible item, and you're going to have no problem finding someone who's interested in it. I would say that this piece, current market, would go for $11,500. OK, that's a lot of money. Well, I appreciate your time, Steve. Maybe I'll call you back later if I see something else. Enjoy it out there, and good luck with all of your uh, items you pick up. Oh, thank you. Were you asking 14000 I was asking fourteen. And I'm, are you pretty firm at that price? I can come down a little bit, but uh, definitely not that much. If you take ten grand for it, I'd love to buy it, but I'm not sure if you will. Uh, how about twelve five? dollars um, That's just going to be too much for me. But I do appreciate you bringing it in, and uh, it's an amazing piece. Thank you. I appreciate it.